Okay, this is the reason, because please, y'all celebrities, please stop telling everyday Americans, man, what to do. We will vote. Calm yourself down. The lady from Hillary Clinton's uh, uh, party called me today and asked me, was it the emails or was it Donald Trump's uh, uh, militia threat? No. We are struggling. You see this right here? <laughs> That is where I got to go vote. I got that. That is my bank account. This right here, property tax. Cars and properties. I got two properties. I got five cars. That right there, that's homeowner's insurance. That right there, that's the light bill I just paid and that's the gas bill I just paid. And underneath all that, that's my checkbooks. And if you look at my bank statement, <laughs> Yeah. Everything together come twenty five hundred to pay everybody. Property tax, homeowners insurance. I got one more bill coming in. My bank account says a thousand dollars. So you know what? I cannot take a day off. You know why? Because I got bills to pay. And if you work in fast food, that means you got a job, but it doesn't give you forty hours because they gotta pay you. Uh, health insurance so that means you got a job but then you got a second job so you go to work from 7 to 3 30 then you go another job from 6 to 11 so mr. Moore we can't take a day off sorry y'all are financially secure America is struggling as far as early voting we can't do that right now either cuz you <laughs> You talking about miss a day, you telling kids to take a day out of school. If my kid got a scholarship and can't miss a day, I wish they would go take a day off to vote. No, we'll vote on that day. So just relax. Take it easy and relax, man. Because at the end of the day, whoever get in the office, they're not rushing to fix America. At the end of the day, who gets into office... We still gonna struggle. We still fighting to live.